Hey guys, it's Donald Wombat here, and I just wanted to thank you, the viewer, for helping my channel get to 1 million total video views. That's a hell of a lot of views, and I really am grateful to you guys. This video is going to be giving back to you guys, so I've got a little bit of a giveaway for you. What I'm going to be giving away is three PS4 light bar decals. So yes, unfortunately, this is only going to be available to you PSV, PS4 guys. I'm not one of those video makers who has a bunch of money to put into giveaways, but it will definitely branch out in the future for sure. If you don't know what a light bar decal is, I'll put a few pictures of them in this video right now, but they are a little sticker that goes over your controller's light bar that leaves the light bar outlining the decal. They are a very cool little addition to any person's PS4 controller, or controller in general. Now these controller decals have been more than generously provided to me by, for this giveaway by Mr. Gasjet. Mr. Gasjet is a local Aussie guy who has built his decal business from the ground up. His work is quality, his prices are great, and he's just a ripper bloke in general. If you want to check out some of his other products he has available, then you should definitely check out his eBay page. I will put a link in the description to it below. To enter the giveaway is super easy. All you have to do is leave a comment down below. To make it even easier, I'll ask a question. If you could have any controller decal in the world, anything at all, what would it be? Any comments will be entered into the draw and there will be three winners. Pretty simple really, and you leave this video a like and possibly even share it, then that will help out a bunch more as well. But that's up to you. Now on to the rest of the video. So the other thing that I wanted to talk about in this video is Call of Duty 2015, or in other words, the Call of Duty title, which is gonna be released later this year. Now I did have a big long depth in discussion thing written down about all the different things that are going on that they're trying to hype it up for the official announcement and all that. But before I could edit and release that video, the bastards over at Treyarch just went and announced it anyway. So the Call of Duty being released this year, as I'm sure you're probably aware, is Black Ops 3. There was so much talk and discussion as to whether it was gonna be Black Ops 3 or World of War 2, and I was almost convinced that they were gonna announce it as World of War 2. All of the evidence pointed towards it, stuff just made sense that it was gonna be World of War 2. But at the same time, Black Ops 2 was probably my favorite Call of Duty, and so I'm really looking forward to the third installment in the series. As the times change, gaming companies really go above and beyond to hype up their products, to obviously try and bump up sales and all of that good stuff. So this year, Call of Duty used this hugely popular smartphone app, Snapchat. About a week or so ago, Black Ops 2 received a very small update. Now, what did this add? Well, some of the posters located throughout the game in missions had a little Snapchat logo on them. What this Snapchat logo was, was a QR code. And if you took a photo of one of these posters in Black Ops 2 in the Snapchat app, the Call of Duty Snapchat account was automatically added to your friends. How insanely clever is that? So a lot of people reported on this little thing and I'm assuming that the Call of Duty Snapchat just blew up entirely. In the days after the Black Ops 2 had this little update, the Call of Duty Snapchat account, Snapchat account started adding little clips and stills to their story, all the way up until they released an official video of it being announced that it was gonna be Black Ops 3. From a marketing point of view, this was awesome. There was so much talk throughout the gaming community in general in the lead up to the announcement, and I think that this little stunt, I suppose you would call it, paid off big time. Anyway, I've talked enough for now, so basically if you want to win yourself some cool little light decals, then all you have to do is leave a comment down below. I'd love to know out of anything what would be the decal you would get. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe to see more videos from me. I've been Wombat, and I'll see you guys later.